What's up, YouTube, man? Back with another video. Back with another, you know, Tim Talks motivational video, or, you know, just not even more. Just me talking, man. Me talking to y'all. I appreciate all the comments, all the love. Y'all been showing on the last video, me talking, man. That's what, you know, just inspired me just to keep going and just seeing the comments, just seeing how y'all interact and seeing how y'all, you know, have y'all takes on what I'm saying. And uh, I love reading y'all comments, you know. It's inspiring me just to keep on going and keep on, you know, do what I'm doing. And um, just want to talk about uh, I had a crazy uh, experience at a gym. At the gym. Do, um, you know, I was just working out, doing my sets or, you know, whatever. And he came up to me and um, and was like, what I was doing today, you know, what I was working on. And we just talked, and that was it. Then um, he came back to me and was like, um, he was asking me, like, um, have you, uh, do you ever feel like you want to cry or, you know, and, um, you know, he just felt, you know, his problems is that he going through and things like that. And, then, you know, it shocked me for him just to, you know, ask me that and, like, you know, because, you know, it's just a random person at a gym or something. Or, you know, y'all talk or, or something. It's just, you know. And I go to say that as, you know, people can see you carrying yourself a different way than other people. And they feel more comfortable coming to you. Or while they see the other person, like, you know, talking about people or talking down on people or something. So it just shocked me and it made me self-reflect. I'm it made me thinking in my mind, like, why would you just tell like a random person? Like, do you ever feel like crying or, you know, you expressing your feelings or how you feeling just to a random person? But I was just thinking about that. And um, it just goes to show just, you know, you walking around with integrity. You walking around, you know, just a, a good, you know, person, kind of hearted person. And, you know, that's I'm just chill, cool, you know. One thing about me, I don't like talking about people like if somebody got some busted up shoes or if somebody, you know, I'm not just going to just talk down on them or, or laugh at them or, you know, kick them while you down. That's just not me, man. And it's just, you know, how I wasn't raised or uh, it just, you know, everybody got their own things. I, I just never like, you know, talking about people or, you know, it's just not me. Then as I was just thinking, reflecting, I'm like. I'm thinking to myself, like, why he was comfortable to tell me that? And it just, it, it just, integrity was just popping in my head every time. It's just like, you know, you do the right things when nobody watching. But, you know, little do you know, it's always somebody watching you. Like, you go to work, you work out, you do something in the public. It's always, and you go there repeatedly. It's going to be somebody watching you every time and little do you know they watching your movement they watching how you you know what you do and how you talk and you know so it was just like he was just that comfortable you telling me his problem telling me what he's going through and um i just want to you know tell people like you know you know just be cool man like you don't gotta talk to down on people like that's what i be seeing all the time and like i, don't, I always try to like you know push those people away from me because i don't like just um people just be always you know talking down or you know or um it's just it's just too negative man i don't like negativity I try to be as positive as possible because this world is so bad what we live in so at least me could be as positive as i can trying to live in a negative world because that's what we live in so i try to be at least as positive walk around cool you know um i don't really say much talk much or you know but if you talk to me i'll talk to you full conversation anything but it's just like i'm not an outgoing person just to you know go around talking to people like that but um you know we talked it up for uh, you know a good uh minute and um you know uh that that really you know uh that really opened my eyes and was like dang like people really be watching you when you don't be looking bro and um you know and i be seeing people all the time be like you know, go out the one ear out the other, but you know, you just dance. It's like when I'm alone or it's a replaying in my head. Like I'm like, dang, why he say that? Or you know, people be like, oh yeah, you inspire me. Or uh, people be seeing my car at the gym or something like that. They be like, oh y'all want to be just like you or something. Or it's just like you know, just those little words 
and I I just be letting it go out the ear, but then I would be reflecting on it when I get home or something like that. But uh, yeah, I just want you know to tell y'all, man, you know, just have integrity, man. Just you know, man, just try to be that positive light anyway. Nobody perfect. I'm not perfect. Like you can just you know work on your bad habits and you know any bad experience you have, just tell people about. It. That's why I was telling him like you know what I was going through with my mom and everything. Like I told him you know use the gym as a escape man you know don't let that pain don't let the devil win because that's what the devil doing he laughing at you he laughing at your misery he laughing at you depressed he laughing at you that you trying to walk up to somebody but that really like helped me and helped him in a way because you know we talking about our personal things we talking about um you know our personal life to get off our chest and the power of you speaking it out loud is like so much than you just thinking in your head. Like as I start doing these t talks, like me just talking about my experience, just talking about, um, you know, my life, talking to y'all. It just, you know, I'm way more open talking about my life and my problems to people and telling them my experience because i was so like i'm so if anybody know i'm like shy i'm like i don't i don't talk like i'm just I'm, i'll be a person in the side of the room just at the table on my phone or just chilling quiet like i'm not a talkative person like i can be quiet i can stay in my room all day and be cool like i'm not bored like i can amuse myself so uh it's like i'm just a you know i'm a real quiet person so um i remember in elementary i got the uh most quiet person uh, reward i wish i still had it but it was crazy man but yeah i always been like a quiet kid so this helped me um be more open and i like being more open i like telling my people my experience experiences and um trying to help them man because that's that's how that's what i feel like my purpose is in life and uh you know um i love just helping people any way i can and uh because we all going through some even though they think i'm just helping them but they really helping me too because me even y'all me just talking saying it out loud is really helping me going through everything because you know and if that's helping y'all you know comment what y'all going through in the comments below or anything because you know life is hard man we all going through something in life and i'm just grateful enough because i'm just a little person man i'm just like y'all we just the same we bleed the same ain't nothing different but um i'm just grateful for him to even have the comfortability to even come to me and, and ask and what to do um what your like he asking for my advice and you know that was a humble experience because you know it was just like dang me out of everybody in the gym you gonna ask me that so it's like man i really do appreciate that and uh you know that's why i love what i do that's why i love you know just talking to people like because it's hard man and uh i've been through a lot of my life and uh and I, I don't want to see nobody go through it or, you know, go through the same mistakes. Or that's why I love talking to older people, too, because, you know, they tell me their experiences, what to go through and what not to do and stuff like that. But, you know, I'm always a listening ear. And I want to just be, you know, more wiser and wiser as I can, man. And so uh, the more knowledge I can get from life, man, because I'm only 25, so I'm just still trying to figure it out life as well. And, uh, you know, it's all a collective group, man. We all just got to come together. What a bit of advice you can have can take me a long way or can take the next person a long way. Like that of advice can any any advice you can 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 stop a person from killing themselves, can stop a person from taking pills or doing something rational. Like for you it just like words do mean a lot because um for you saying it out loud, it can and it can affect a life because you you got to think on a positive side, we don't think it do nothing to somebody or we overlook it because it's positive. But when somebody say something to you negative, like you ready to shoot somebody, you ready to kill them. Like why you think people be dying from gang bangs and they say all they saying just words to each other and it's affecting them. And now they finna go out and kill each other like other people roll rage and like you got to think like just how powerful a word can make somebody else want to kill them the same thing with positivity we got to take like that positivity can make somebody be a millionaire 
you could say something to some you could say something to them positive that can change their whole life around okay i love what he said to me he 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 see something in me that i didn't now he finna go harder in his job his life anything he finna do he blew up a millionaire so i, I just thinking of like that too because as much as negative that can make a person change their life or can make somebody do something crazy is you gotta think it's a positive too and the positivity can make somebody life do a whole 360 just from you having a, a quick conversation or you having a 30 minute hour conversation with them and um it really could change people's life man words is powerful and um just speaking it out loud is powerful and uh i just you know love what i do i love just talking to y'all man and uh i wanted to, to uh get that experience and tell y'all that man and uh yeah that was the craziest that was my first time ever you know somebody ever doing that to me coming up to me and doing like that was it was just crazy man it was so crazy it was like you know how like when you get a uh, stage fright or your knees get weak and it's like because it's i don't know become a shot dude so it's just like you just coming to me saying that and it was shot more for me too because i had to you know open up a little bit and, and tell him what i was going through too and tell him you know we all going through something and um and uh, one thing I want to, uh, one thing I said to him too is, uh, you know, my problem and your problem is the same. It don't matter if it's big or small; it's gonna be the same because we don't know mentally what you can handle. You don't know mentally what I can handle. So just because you can say your dog died or your mother died, it's still the same problem. You can't compare problems and say, oh, my problem bigger than yours, so you shouldn't be. That's sad. I should be more sadder than you. No, bro. We can't look at it like that. We got to look at it as the same thing because I don't know what you could be capable of handling mentally. We all ha have different minds. We all have different mentals. You know, we all have different struggles. So I don't know what you can handle. That's why I always tell them, you know, every problem is the same, man. That's why I tell them we all going through the same thing. And, you know, we're going to get through this together. Every time I, just, every time I see him in the gym, I always ask him. He I, he even asked me too, man, are you okay? You know, you doing good? You know, we just check up on each other every time. And, uh, and that's good, man. And, uh, yeah, I just felt weak in the knees, bro, um, just from talking because, you know, I'm not used to, most definitely not used to, you know, just talking to anybody, you know, about my uh, feelings or anything in person. So, you know, it was a cool experience, man, and uh, I like that. And, uh, you know, I think that was just God, man. That was just God, you know, putting me in a position to tell him because, you know, hundreds of people in the gym, you could just come up to me randomly, so it's like, yeah, man, and uh, I do appreciate all the fan love support. Appreciate y'all, you know, for letting me open up to y'all. I and mean, I love talking to y'all, you know, just give me, it's like a therapy session, man. It really is. And uh, just comment y'all questions y'all want me to answer or questions y'all got for me, questions that you, you know, going through or anything like that or what my perspective you want to hear me have a take on it. Just comment it down below. Appreciate y'all. Have a blessed day. Peace and love.